Okay, so what I wanna do is I wanna test for your cervical spine. So we're gonna do a muscle IQ examination here. I want you to, I want you to grip right here. And, and then, so grip right like that. So we're gonna do supination right here. So hold, you're pushing down that way. Hold there, okay, now hold here. Grip, hold, okay. Then we're gonna go here and we're gonna do pronation. So you can hold down that way, good. And we're gonna do it this way, hold. Then we're gonna do a grip right here. Bend the wrist towards you, hold there, okay, good. And we're gonna grip right here, pull in right there. Keep your elbow in and hold there. That one doesn't hold very well. And your joints pop and everything, but you can't hold that very well. So you have a weakness with your flexors. So we're gonna go in, hold there, in, hold there. We're gonna go out, hold there, hold there. Spread your fingers apart, okay. Spread your fingers apart. Okay, then thumb coming across, hold there, pushing back out that way, hold there, thumb coming across, hold, pushing back out. So hold there, that was a little weak too. That was not holding. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna test you lying down on your back. What I have you do is you come into this position, you're gonna grip, bend your wrist right there, hold like that, keep your elbow straight, hold like that. So now what happened is your, your uh, shoulder went weak. You notice that part? Mm -hmm. So if you didn't have that grip, hold here. So hold there. Okay, now we grip right like that. There you go. And then you hold and your shoulder goes weak. So now I'm gonna go and search for s some strength. So right there. Yeah, right there you go stronger. Okay, so now come real close into here so we see right where I'm going, right into here. And that's your sore spot, yeah. So I can release it and, and basically neutralize the pain. This is called pain neutralization technique by Stephen Kaufman. But I figured out like a different way to neutralize it than what he taught necessarily. But So we're gonna go right in like that. And what I'm touching right here is the front side of the longest colon. And you have a little bit of, ten of tendonitis right there. So I'm gonna press into it and try to release that tendonitis. It's a hard spot, kind of gummy. So I'm gonna push on it and just kind of release it. I'm underneath the sternocleidomastoid, kind of going in between the scalenes. So, and that hurts, but so we're gonna go right there. Okay, then we're gonna go right there. Ow, and then it's going right there? There. Okay, so sometimes we can go right where it's referring pain to. What about that? That's okay. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna, after the treatment, we're gonna retest just to see if we need to do anything more. So bend right there and grip like you're doing. Hold with your shoulder. So hold there, okay. Now, sometimes we need to do the opposite side. Yep, right there. So we're gonna come down, most of the time we have to do the opposite side, actually. But, yeah, so we go into there. There it is. <laughs> and then we're gonna push through here. Do you have referral down the arm? Not yet. Not yet. Okay, so, then, so we're gonna go right there. Okay, it's there. Okay, right there. Okay, here we go. Does that help? Yes. Okay. Okay, we're gonna retest again. So go ahead and grip right here, bend your wrist, hold straight, then hold the shoulder too, and that's getting better. Okay, now let's just see, go ahead and sit up, and let's test it. Okay, so here we go. You're gonna grip right here, bend that way, and now hold strong there. Okay, now hold strong. Okay, let me just chest that compared to there. Bend that in. Yeah, there. There. Much stronger. Okay. All right. Oh, and then we had this one pushing out, pushing down here. Okay, so push down. That one we still need to work on. That's a lower level that we're gonna have to get to down into lower levels of the cervical down into T1-ish area too, probably. But, okay, all right, we'll work on that one next.